Next up is Lane Schrantz, driving a 99 Chevy Monte Carlo. The chassis was actually uh, built uh, over 20 years ago, and we just keep modifying it and changing it. And uh, it's got a, a small block Chevrolet V8, similar to a NASCAR motor, a little over 700 horsepower. And it's lots of horsepower. It's rear wheel drive, so it's hard to get all that horsepower to the ground and get traction, but it's a lot of fun to drive. I think anytime there's a challenge that uh, family and friends, like our pit crew, and can face, it draws you together. It gives you a, a common goal, a common purpose, and that's always great for relationships. There's tons of camaraderie, not just within the family, but, uh, but also with the guys that work on the car. I mean, it, it gives you a reason to not just go home from work at 5 o'clock and watch TV the rest of the night. You know, it gives you a reason to get back together work till midnight or sometimes all the way through the night. fame of the mountain is the draw to the mountain. The mountain itself is just probably the most beautiful race course in the world. And it brings people together, it brings us together, it brings our friends together, and we have a lot of fun doing it. Right off the start line, first, second, great, went into third, and it just, just grinded and went into neutral and had to bang it into third gear. And then from then on, it was in my head. And any time I had to hit third gear with tire spin, it wouldn't go in. And uh, I was happy with how I drove the road. It's really slick. So Bobby turned in a really good time for such a slick road. But uh, I mean, I went as fast as I could go, but it was frustrating every time you had to shift. So Bobby Register does in fact win the 85th super stock running of the hill climb with a winning margin of 11.46, some five seconds better than second place finisher Lane Schranz. In third place is Tyler Casebeer, just a second behind in his 04 Ford Mustang. 